Quandale Dingle here. <laughs> Quandale Dingle. <laughs> Matthew, hey, bro, you got a phone call. Oh, 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 oh. Hello, Mario. Oh, look at the class, look at the boat. What the dog doing? <laughs> no more Robux generator. It's morbid time. Hey, I'm pizza here. My ears burn! Yeah. Why is Mr. Tree? What do you mean by that? <laughs> you what? Oh my goodness. Legalize nuclear bombs. Hello everyone, welcome back to yet another Road to Elite Smash, and for this Road to Elite Smash, I think we're just going to go back to another single character from a single series that we have done in the past, and I haven't really done a lot of technical characters for Road to Elite Smash, I think I've done characters like Lucas and U2, which are a lot more technical in a sense, but today I'm going to be talking about a really technical character that many people may not think is technical, but he actually really is, it is Mega Man. Uh, Mega Man does not by any means a very simple character, and I struggled playing with him a lot. This black and yellow skin looks really, really clean on him. It's supposed to reference base from the Mega Man games, but I just seriously think it's a really cool skin, so let's hope we can get some easy matches despite these technicalities. Well, am I seeing double, or is that another Mega Man? It looks like we'll be playing the Ditto today on Delfino Plaza as well, and... Alright, let's see what he knows and what I know, and we got the crash bomber on him with those lemons, that dash attack. And another flame sword. This is forward air. So yeah, Mega Man has a lot of cool moves that he can use, so we're trying to take advantage as much of them as we can. And that dash attack does a lot of da not much damage, but it has a lot of hit. It was at this moment Jackson knew. He fucked up. It's and is really good. That up tilt's really good. Tim was able to show us off that here, and unfortunately had to die for it. That down smash is also really good. If tech isn't bad. So yeah, Metal Blade is his Metal Blade. That's his Leaf Shield down B. Up smash, taking a kill with that. So yeah, his Metal Blade is a nice projectile. You can use it in any direction. Does some more damage. Travels great with Scratch Attack. That's his F smash. You can charge it up, and it acts like a projectile. Just a flame sword in over there. All right. Yeah, yeah, I know he's one in that, so... Metal Blade Dash Attack, alright. Let's go deep for this one. Mm. Alright, didn't get the spike on that one, but it's still... still managed to cut up on top. Alright. Goes for the down throw. Alright, look at Lee, he missed the tornado on that one. And as you can see, we can throw the Metal Blade behind us, and it can go in angles as well. Right. In case you haven't noticed... Wise Mystical Tree. Dead! Alright, wa watch out for that. But perfect! We got the kill with that up smash. And that leaf shield can be pretty hard to deal with if you don't know what you're doing, but we beat our clone and are on the next one. Alright, looks like we're starting off this match with just the neutral special. Kind of looks like he's just shooting lemons, which I think is pretty funny. Alright, see he's trying to give me a uh, dash attack. Not going to happen. Alright, good combo. Metal play dash attack, always reliable, and gets the spike with it. And it even saves this as well. That crash bomber into the stage that he did earlier. Do some leaf field damage, more dash attack damage, forward air to lead. Breathe. No downer, but it's alright. Still leaving, still have all three stocks. You just gotta be careful now. And I know that up tilt, very dangerous, alright? <laughs> you fool! I got hit by it twice. I gotta hit, hit it myself now, but uh, it's very much a bad thing if you miss it as you're. Trapped in a lot of end lag. So, just trying to get that distance with a metal blade. Alright, looks like we picked up ours. Huh? Alright. Oh, yikes. Couldn't use mine to recover. 192. He should be dead pretty soon. Just need one good hit on him. Hot his metal blade. Nice. Mid air. And beat him out. Get it in that up smash. Alright, last stock for both of us. And we only need to take this last stock to get into a lead smash. Thankfully, this hasn't been too hard on us. 
Oh, the last didn't connect, so it buffered an air dodge from him. Good up smash. Alright, come on. Just a little bit more now. Another good dash attack. Alright, shield from that. Oh! Uh, alright. That was his own crash bomber that defeated him. And we were just smarter of it all. Well, it was a lot more simpler than I expected getting Mega Man into Elite Smash. You know, Mega Man being a very technical character, it turns out that I didn't really need to do that much. I just had to let the other Mega Man just sit back and relax and have him do all the work for me, I guess. I guess that's what robots are good for anyways. But yeah, Mega Man with a lot of different moves, a very technical character. I didn't even scratch the surface of what I can do with Mega Man. And while, of course, this would be the part where I would go in and um, into arena battles with my friends and just play some more Mega Man, I'm not really good at Mega Man, and I am quite content with just having a lead smash with him. It was honestly not that bad to play Mega Man, and while I wouldn't play him again, it was still an overall pretty great experience. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to leave a like down below, comment, and subscribe. It would definitely help me out a lot, and definitely keep the support on those videos just keep on coming i will see you guys in the next one and until then peace out and make it a great day everyone